MTB Draft Challenge Slam. I'm gonna beat him. You going down, man. So Mike and I are out in the boat right now. We're both doing the hand cam. We've got a MTB Pro Box on the boat today. We are gonna be doing the MTB Pro Box Draft Challenge. And what you do for that is you're gonna take turns picking baits out of this box, do a little fish off, me versus you. Biggest three fish win, there's six baits, we each get three. We can register the biggest fish on each of these baits. All right, let's choose baits, dude. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot to see who picks first. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah. All right, you get first pick, man. All right. Oh, this month's box is pretty good. I already took a sneak peek in here. Oh yeah, we got a crankbait, spinnerbait. All right, frog, okay. Frog's probably Tungsten. gonna be the hardest one. Tungsten. First one, I'm gonna go with the Ima Pinjack 200. All right. First choice for me. The, uh, I'm gonna go with the Tungsten. You can do a lot of stuff with this. For any plastic bait I want on this. Yeah, that's a good And call. Uh, I'm gonna need a moving bait, so let's go with the uh, spinnerbait. All right, so then I pick two, right? Yep, you got two next. All right, so I'm gonna go... I know what you're gonna leave me with. Drop shot and uh, swim bait. Yeah. And I'm left with a frog, and it's pretty cold out here. How cold was it this morning, man? 32, 34. 32 degrees. I'm gonna try to have to do something interesting with this frog to try to make it work. <laughs> we'll see. Fishing, uh, doing a five hour draft challenge. We'll see who has the biggest three fish at the end. All right, hang on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, come on. Come on. Oh, there we go. I'm throwing is the pin jack 200 this is a decent little crankbait it's not in the best color but I think maybe we'll get them to bite on it yesterday we were catching them on hard baits slow moving hard baits so hopefully it works huh? there he is. what you got him Dude, I'm still rigging up. Oh, really dude, that's a nice one. What? John B. Barely tapped. The first five minutes in the slam. Hooks up with a giant. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh! Oh, dude. Look how he ate what? that, dude. Look at that chunk, man. Oh, man. What a way to start the slam challenge. Clearly, John B. <laughs> takes the lead. Look how this dude ate that pin jack. It didn't feel like anything because he went right up behind it and just annihilated it. Is <laughs> that pin jack? That. Dude, that's a legit. Is that giant fish? Look at that fat belly. Maybe three pounds, maybe. Yeah, two and three quarters, three pounds. First Easy. fish for the MDB slam. <laughs> Woo! I'm on the board. <laughs> There's one. Got that him. One? I got him. Who's not going? Oh, yeah. I'll take it. Oh, no. In the boat. <laughs> on the trailer hook. Nice. Good thing we put that on. Oh, dude, he swiped at it. Look at this. Is that, is that the Stanley? Yeah. Barely got him on the trailer hook. This is why you use a trailer hook. Right there. Get away. Yep. Alright, well, you're definitely in the lead still, man. You're on the board. I'm on the board, though. Mike's on the board. On the board. Nice job. Thanks, man. Dude, Josh just hooked up with a giant. On this little tiny oh, what? fish head. Fish Dude, head I got food. bites over here too. I think there's a school bass over here. Like fish anchor down. I'm going to drop this back anchor down. Oh, yes! Nice, Look at man. that. Oh what? my god. Look how tiny that little lure is. Oh man, that's on that little, uh, what is this thing called? Gambler Shaky Shad. Nice, man. On Fishy. a fish head spin. Another, like, absolute chunk. Oh man. Woo. On that little bait? Solid. Oh. Two and three quarters? 3.28. Yeah. Dang, you crushed no, 3. it. 3.26. Oh. oh yeah, dude, that thing is fat. Look at that. On that connect scale. What a fish. Yeah, so that last uh, big old gal came on this little presentation right here. This is a great presentation for cold water, cold fronts, 
good in the early spring, but also kind of works in the fall as well. It's like a fast moving bait that's got a whole lot of flash and a little movement that doesn't have too much action on the back end, but a whole lot of action on the underneath. And it works really well when you're trying to fish up some of those finicky bass. The next bait is the Kickerfish Bait Company Tail Slapper. It's kind of like a Kitex swim bait, but I believe this is a little less expensive. And you know what? I'm just going to cut a little piece off and put it on the back of this uh, fish head spin or whatever this brand is. I don't know what it's called. If they're, if, if they're catching, if you're catching them on a certain technique, then there's no point in switching. Mike's got one. <laughs> Dude, I thought it was a giant when it hit. It's swimming off. And I, I got a... Did you get it on the drop? Yeah, the drop shot. Oh, no way. As soon as it hit... It's actually a decent fish. Got a light line. <laughs> got him. There you go. We'll take it. Tungsten using it as a drop shot weight. It works. Kind counts. Of creative, right? You were creative with your last fish, man. Yeah, nice fish. About pounding. <laughs> My two fish don't weigh as much as your one fish, bro. <laughs> Still, though. That's good scale out. It's kind of long. Maybe we'll put five. 1.58, all right. Take it. Make it a picture. Sure. Yeah, it looks like finesse might be the deal. I, I was using the spinner bait, the br brush hog, first cast with the drop shot. Bam. Now third bait for me. I gotta get something on the. Uh, yeah, we, now we're both now on like the. Our last bait. Last bait. Are you kidding me? Oh, nice. Dude! Just barely had it. Oh no! Dude! This might upgrade. Dude, that might be an upgrade! No way. Are you fishing the third bait or the second bait still? This is, no, I haven't filled it Okay, so you might be an upgrade, gotcha. Nice fish. Did that dock? Yeah. Oh, nice, maybe. dude! That's an upgrade, what? Look at that fish. Holy smokes. This little gambler on this uh, underspin. It's just money. I mean, he barely hit it too. Wasn't like a real prominent hit. All right, time to get a weight on this puppy. Oh, nice. Is he gone? No, he's still. Oh, dude. Nice one. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that was a really nice one. Dude, that would have been the final bait for you. That was such a nice bag. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my gosh. <laughs> See how big it was though? Dude, yeah, it looked like a three, man. It looked it looked like three and a half. Dude, every fish you catch is a freaking three. Freaking three magnet, man. So much for a trailer hook, jeez. No way. We missed it. Oh my gosh. You see another one? Yeah. Holy crap. That was, that was a nice fish too. What? No way! Yeah. He's in the brush. Oh no, dude! He's in the brush. Is, did he come out? Dude. He's still on. Do we need to pull a banker? Pull a banker? Yeah. Yeah, he's still on. He's still on? Yeah. <laughs> this is that big. I'm gonna get the front anchor. I'm gonna kill him. Oh, dude. Chasing your fish down, man. Is he still on there? Yeah. No way! Dude, epic! He's off now. Is he off? Oh, dude, there he is! Nice get him in! Get him in! Nice get him in! It's a nice one. <laughs> dude, like a what a fish! This is like a three or two. <laughs> yes! yes. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Boom! God, he destroys the slam! Boom! Right here, guys! Dude! Oh, oh my god! god. Pull. Dude! Uh, pull. Oh my god! Look at that! <laughs> Look at that, guys! His line just broke. Oh, oh my god. Dude, I can't believe that. <laughs> that was on the kicker fish slail ta uh, tail sla slail tapper. Tail <laughs> slapper. <laughs> on a, on the back of a spinner bait. Now they're probably about two and a quarter, two and three quarters fish. Oh my god. The matter is, is he was just hung up in that brush and he just stayed there and he figured figured it out and got himself un untangled, I believe. So real I can't awesome believe he stayed catch. on it the whole time, man. That was insane. It's like our first real shallow fish of the day, kinda. Oh man, oh man. This right here is the bait that I caught that last fish on. I'm a huge believer in spinner baits and dirty water. I generally fish Colorado in shallow water, but today the water's cold. Um, kind of want to go something a little bit more subtle, push a little less water. And I like that big gold blade on there, especially in dirtier, muddier water. But I found today the water's a little bit more clear. So our shallow, dirty water spots are no longer shallow and dirty, they're more shallow and clear. I found these fish are pushed off some of the really shallow laydowns and kind of on the edge. You know, we've only found so many fish in the laydowns. I had two really good bites, actually three really good bites over there. Missed one fish and then got that other one. But um, this little spinnerbait can be amazing. I usually use this technique in the springtime, but it can work in the fall too. The bait that I'm throwing on the back, they're a little 
kicker fish uh, tail slapper, I think it's called. Yeah, that little dude kind of helps me slow the spinnerbait down. It falls a little bit slower, and the rate of fall just overall is a little bit more subtle, but that kind of helps me not only adds to the presentation and the overall look of the bait, but it helps keep my bait at a good pace too, and it, and it really works well when I'm just kind of bumping it over these limbs, these tree limbs that are down there, just over brush piles and lay downs. Awesome technique for that in between cold and warm weather, as you saw right there. So, back at it. Got like, what, 15 minutes left? Yeah. Just about out of time. I'm gonna need a, a about a 10 pound fish to catch up to this guy right here. <laughs> you, can, you can land a seven. <laughs> End of the MTB challenge. We are going up right now to get some grub because I'm hungry and uh, I'm sure you're hungry too, but how was it? In one word, explain today's bite In one compared word? to yesterday's. Oh, 100% better. I guess one word would be Improvement. <laughs> Improvement. I like that. The bird blue skies actually worked to our advantage today. We had a little less wind, and sometimes the wind helps, sometimes it hurts. I think yesterday it was hurting us, but we figured it out. So we're going to head in. Had an awesome challenge with Mike. <laughs> I'm afraid that if we go back out in the water, he has more intel and he's probably going to smoke me. So uh, that was a fun little quick one. We don't have to for three hours, four hours yeah, like that. Man, you so, took it to him, man. Congrats again on the win. That was fun. Hope you guys liked the video. If you guys want to see Mike's video, which is all like chess cam and you, different perspective of it. Check out the link right here. You can click on this dude's face, boom. And that'll link you right to his channel. Then maybe eventually the video, depending on who uploads it first. You'll probably get on it before I do. But uh, that was fun. That was definitely fun. So stay tuned for more stuff like this. You know, we may even film when we get back on the water, depending on how good the bite is. So. Peace, guys.